Hillsboro Television News Breaks, connecting you to county events. I'm Gerald abdul -Wasi. I'm the director here at the Community Housing Solutions Center. And uh, following the uh, comments from the county, from the commissioner, we're going to take you on a tour of our facility. Welcome to the beautiful DACO Community Housing Solutions Center. <laughs> I'm Antoinette Triplett, the Chief Executive Officer for the Tampa Hillsboro Homeless Initiative. I would like to take the opportunity just to tell you a little bit about the Tampa Hillsboro Home, uh, Homeless Initiative and uh, our role in opening the Community Housing Solutions Center. So the beautiful um, facility that we're located in is part of our plan for the community in order to reduce the number of people that experience homelessness and also the length of time that they experience homelessness. If it was just a shelter, it wouldn't fit us. That's absolutely right. But because people stay here up to four months, um, we're able to provide health care, the wraparound behavioral health issues that may um, uh, plague the person that's homeless, as well as helping them find a home um, and um, education, which the Hillsborough County School System is providing a teacher here for us. So all those things wrapped together make it a real uh, wraparound service that's not just a shelter for one night. I won't be afraid to speak about what happened to me because my words might help somebody else. What I say may uplift someone to do the impossible, or what they believe may be impossible. Homelessness, as you did state, is not a, a final thing. It's, it's not who you are. It's temporary. And, and we see that here today. A lot of the help that we've received just in this building alone was immense. It was overwhelming, kind of, um, from our caseworkers, Mr. Amen, who worked with us from the first day, Mr. Ricks, who, when we got here, welcomed us with, you know, open arms. Um, just coming from a different place, leaving the military, um, feeling like nobody really wanted to help. It's kind of different. And I think a lot of you all who see here today, board members, uh, people who allowed this to happen, from my heart, from my wife's heart, from my Unborn, unborn child's heart, I thank you. Thank you very much. It's that quality of, and dignity of life that we are bringing to the homeless in our community. We realize we need a serious transformation for how we're, we're addressing homelessness. This is, uh, it's not just excitement today, it's, um, it's emotional, and we are ending homelessness. There is a vision to end it. Uh, the first time we have broken down the barriers for all the people to work together, the city, the county, all of our private sector and stakeholders, uh, we're building that foundation, uh, I believe, to really work together and solve this problem. But we know it's gonna take one homeless person at a time. One person at a time. Even though I've only been here a short time, it has allowed me to, you know, accomplish uh, things I would have never been able to accomplish uh, being out on the street. And I can't offer, I, I, I offer, I can't offer enough thanks. This can do wonders for a lot of people. I am very pleased to say that it has uh, changed my expectations and my mindset. I think it is a top-notch program. I think that the county, it is well needed uh, within the county, and I'm very proud to say that I am a, a resident here. But I can honestly say that the people that live here, the ones that we came here with, they've become more family than our actual family. The staff, Mr. M and our counselor at that time, Ms. Ricks, they 
were so much a help and anything that we needed. You just get to that point where you start to lose hope. And this place has given me, it's, it's brought back my hope. It upholds you, it shelters you. I have been so impressed with the staff and the way the facility is run. It's a chance to kind of give back, um, to a chance to help me get my feet back on the ground and stand on some solid ground, um, as well as to give back to those that um, are here in the facility that have helped me uh, accomplish my dreams. Mm -hmm.